Hi and welcome to Evil Test of Videos. What we're going to do in this video is have a quick overview of the Chrome DevTools snippets functionality. Now snippets functionality lets us create little bits of code, code that we would normally just run at the console, stuff that we're going to have to do over time if you need to hack these applications. And what we can do is we can create a new snippet this one's going to be called script snippet number three, because that's a good number. What this is going to do is this is going to generate 10 slogans at the console. So I'm going to rename that to be 10 slogans. Now what I can do here is I can pre print this so it's nice and easy to read. Remember, control S to save these snippets. Then I can simply run these snippets and they will run without me having to type anything to the console, which is quite a handy little thing. Now, if you create a lot of snippets, you're going to want to import and export them. That's not something that is officially supported in the developer tools. So we're going to have to use code that other people have written. So here's a gist that someone has written that will let us to export and import the snippets. In order to use this, I have to get the raw version of this code. So I'm copy and pasting the raw code. But I can't input the code in this DevTools. I have to create a DevTools for this DevTools, which means I'm opening DevTools. Then I'll do Control shift i inside the DevTools to create another DevTools window. But this is the DevTools for this DevTools. And in the console here, I can paste the snippet. Then I get access to the GUI that will help me export the current snippets to a JSON file. Then I can drag that JSON file back in here to import the snippets. So feel free to experiment with this. Then you can save the snippets if you start using them a lot. But the most important thing to experiment with is when you create custom code in the console, start creating snippets for it so that you can rerun those easily.